Well, remember those human remains that someone found while walking in the woods near Woodburn in Allen County last month? Well, as Fort Wayne's NBC reporter Corinne Rose tells us tonight, the case has stumped local investigators who are now turning to anthropologists in Indianapolis for help. The primary focus still at this point in time is make the identification and then where was the person last known to be who was last known to be with. Allen County Coroner Chief Investigator Michael Burris says after examining the remains, a forensic pathologist and a forensic dentist were not able to identify them. Someone found the clothed skeleton on private property off Norman Road near Woodburn last month. It was sitting on a fallen log while leaning against a tree. Based on its condition, Burris estimates it had been there for six to eight months and says the person may have sat down and died or was placed there by someone else. A team of anthropologists from the University of Indianapolis helped catalog and recover the remains. Investigators here used dental records from four missing people, but none matched. Thursday, Burris will drive the remains to Indianapolis for the anthropologists to examine and hopefully determine whether any of the bones had been damaged by foul play, as well as give crucial information. We should have a height, weight, sex, age, and race of the individual. And then they will go ahead and submit samples for DNA testing. If those DNA samples don't come back with a match in databases, investigators here will reach out to local families. We'll narrow it down and we'll start going specifically back to families going, we need DNA uh, samples from parents, brothers and sisters. Burris expects the DNA process to take several weeks. Corinne Rose, Fort Wayne's NBC. And as we've previously reported, investigators do not believe the remains are those of missing Fort Wayne man, Kevin Wynn. Well.